It's raising money for the victims of those earthquakes in Syria and Turkey. Our Gabrielle May is joining us now. And Gabby, today we're learning doctors play a very special role in this effort. Yeah, that's true. So Hyatt Pharmacy says it will donate or match the donations up to $50,000. We also talked to a doctor who was in Jordan last year. He says he was helping Syrian refugees, and he says he's willing to go back and help again. I'm there already whenever they tell me to go. If they give me one week notice, I have to be there. Dr. Walid Najib is waiting for his phone to ring so he can help earthquake victims in Turkey and Syria. When you hear that there's an earthquake with that magnitude, really that's overwhelming. He just got back from a trip to Jordan where he helped Syrian refugees. So more than 4,000 patients during that time. We did more than 400 surgeries. Uh, we, we did so many dental procedures. He's also a member of the Syrian American Medical Society, which is teaming up with Hyatt Pharmacy to accept donations to earthquake victims. The Medical Society says donations will be used to treat people who are injured, and donations will also help to purchase medical supplies. We need really to respond and help other fellow human beings when they are in stress like that. That's why Hyatt Pharmacy is stepping in. We came up with this idea, a match, a dollar for a dollar match for up to $50,000. He says Milwaukee is the type of community willing to help others. By far, it's the most generous community I've lived in. So if you're interested in helping donate, we have a link in my story on fox6now.com. So far, I did look at last check. The pharmacy has raised $1,500. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Gabrielle Mays, Fox 6 News. Oh, that's nice. All right. Gabrielle, thank you.